Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel. Today we are diving into a fascinating piece of history. The story of steel wool. So let's roll up our sleeves and get started. In the Victorian times, there was this unique utensil known as the wire dishcloth. Imagine this, a metal wire handle with dozens of small circles of steel intertwined, used for cleaning and cutting through stubborn grease and grime. It was a household essential, the go-to tool for scrubbing down cast iron or aluminum pots. Moving to a slightly different setting, the mechanics working on metal lathes stumbled upon a handy discovery. The metal shavings that were left after working on parts or tools turned out to be more than just waste. The rumor has it, they were collected and used to polish metal surfaces long before the turn of the 20th century. This ingenious idea evolved into the mass production of steel wool in the early 1900s. A new star was born in American kitchens when soap-soaked steel wool pad became a must-have. These were made by mixing leftover steel turnings with soft soap. There's a bit of a debate about who exactly came up with the idea to produce and sell these soap-soaked steel wool pads first. But it was around the World War I period when entrepreneurs realized the potential of these pads especially for cleaning the shiny new aluminum cookware, decided to throw in these pads as a bonus. And guess what? They worked like a charm? Of course, there's always a downside. These steel wool pads could rust if left wet, which led to the invention of synthetic, rust-proof alternatives that resemble the look and feel of steel wool. Look at this, a colorful, sponge-like scrubber made entirely of synthetic fibers. Sure, they don't rust, but the question is, do they clean as effectively as the original steel wool? Well, critics argue that these synthetic pads just can't duplicate the cutting edges of steel wool. And there you have it. The evolution of steel wool, from Victorian pot scrubbers to modern synthetic alternatives. Who knew cleaning tools had such an intriguing history? Thanks for tuning in to today's episode. Don't forget to hit the like button if you found it interesting and subscribe for more cool history deep dives. Until next time, stay curious.